Hello, Hero, and welcome back from the weekend. Well, it looks like a compelling day after a full weekend of transformation. Pluto is finally in Capricorn. I know you're just thrilled to hear that. But as we kick this off, we actually have a soul pyramid in air. This means that intellectually, most of the signs on the planet will come to some sort of greater understanding, an epiphany, if you will, over their lives. I say epiphany because air signs basically come down to us thinking or talking about something. And for the Arieses, this comes down to a grand trine between three areas of your life. It's triggered by the moon, which continues in Libra today. So emotionally, your heart is with your marriages, and that may be one-third of the overall issue. So marriages and emotion tie into Neptune, which is intuition and in the house of society. So the universe is trying to get your heart to kind of contemplate the possibilities of elevating in society. And at the bottom of the soul pyramid, the retrograde Mars in Gemini, transiting your house of communication. So the best way to talk about this is this. I think in the next 24 hours, you may have some sort of understanding that ties your emotions around marriages to your ideas of where you're going to go in society and then down into really you rethinking a communication, you having to have a communication over again. It could be an epiphany that triggers you to have another conversation with somebody, probably with a marital partner or probably with someone that influences you in society. And that is because the retrograde Mars in the house of thinking communication. Now Mars will only be retrograde, strangely enough, until Thursday, it goes direct, which means we start moving forward again with our actions. But unfortunately, as of tomorrow, Mercury goes retrograde. Ugh. All right, Aries, that's all we have to kick off this week. Look for your epiphany, and I'll see you tomorrow. Live, love, be. So